database categorizes. Here we will apply same auditing concept what we applied in application categorization. So first let us check what is the requirement in information security policy. So this is the information security policy of the organization. We need to search for categorization. Okay, so okay asset categorization okay so clause number 16 is about asset categorization okay so if you see application and database should be categorized as per following nomenclature now database containing restricted and confidential data as defined in clause 10 should be categorized as critical also any other application or data by database as determined critical by the application or database owner should also be considered as critical other than that all other database will be considered as other important now let us check what is clause 10 so in clause 10 we need to check restricted and confidential data clause 10 okay so this is clause 10 data classification okay so all this data should be part of restricted and other than this all other data will be will become part of other important database okay so again this is database categorization now let us check what organization has done okay so they have categorized all the database a b c d that's good now what we need to check whether this categorization is done correctly so for example we need to check storage of data what kind of data is stored if any restricted or confidential data is stored then it should have been categorized as critical so accordingly you need to ask for supporting documents and evidence to validate the categorization let us assume that categorization is done correctly and checkpoint is complied. Let us highlight this with green. Let us now discuss next data field that is operating system.